Daddy Cakes. Welcome sa part 2 vlog natin kung saan sinowcase ko yung all-time favorite toys in making. Since more than 5 months na kami operating dito sa Negros, nadagdagan naman yung mga tools na gagamitin namin. For today's video, I will be showing you the tools that we recently used on our fondant cakes. And at the end of the video, I will answer random questions from the netizens. So keep watching until the end! So sobrang excited ko, binusan ko na yung mga naunang parcel. Sobrang haggard na yung bakeries nyo. Parang hindi na madrawing yung mukha eh. Thank you, Kari, Manong Rider. I'm Ping. First things first, the fondant smoother. We have different types of smoother. The round. The square. And for flat ones. Flat. <laughs> well, anyways, I was convinced to buy it because it was easy to use and napapabilis yung pag-cover ko ng fondant especially sa sides sa side ng fondant para maiwasan din yung kulubot next we have scraper obviously I love pink um, ginagamit to siya pang scrape sa buttercream icing next we have a pen knife I was convinced to buy it because mahirap naman po kutsilyo yung gagamitin pang carb, pang scalp, pang mold sa fondant, especially sa mga toppers na ginagawa ko. Next, we have tweezer. This is so very useful kasi ito yung ginamit ko pang dikit sa mga dragis or maliliit na beads. For example, instead of using my fingers, ito po, it's safe to use. Hindi ko masisira yung fondant. Next, we have edible pens. Marami to siyang color, pero ito lang yung dalawang binili ko. The black and the red. Because priority to siya for our orders. Don't worry, edible pens are edible and eatable. Non-toxic at all. It's safe to use. Next, we have a plaster dust. This is also edible. Non-toxic at all. Next, we have a different set of paintbrush. Next, another set of letterings for fondant. Elegant letters, big and small letters with numbers. Next, we have a cake tester. Isn't it cute? Next, salamat shopping. This is a dump cake, dummy cake, or cake styro. I was convinced to buy it because ginagamit ko siya sa mga 4 years. Especially sa mga wedding cake. Ito, dummy styro or dummy cake. Next, we have number mold. I was convinced to buy it because mas easy siyang gamitin kesa naman yung mag-curve ka. Sayang yung cake. At least ito yung isang full recipe na consume siya sa isang container. So that's it. Napakita ko na sa inyo lahat ng bagong tools na gagamitin ko sa mga fondant cakes ko. Fondant na, ma'am? Yes! Lahat po ng cakes namin dito sa Jojot Cakes Art ay fondant. We don't use any other icing. 
kasi mas mabilis magmold, magdecorate yung fondant. Maka-create ka ng ano mo, beyond imagination mo. Makaon na? Yes, ma'am. Makaon jud ni ma'am. May kasabihan nga tayong the eye eats first. Yes, katakam-taham na yan siya. Yung design pa lang yan. Stiletto heel. Ganon. Nakakain po yan lahat, ma'am. Edible po yan lahat. We don't use props po. For example po, yung sa luxury theme cake namin, um, yung nasa taas po niyan is Mr. Wonderful. Sa picture niya po is plastic topper. But, we designed it and made it as a fondant topper. Cake yan, ganda. Yes po ma'am, cake po yan ma'am, made out of fondant icing. Nagpa-customize po yung customer namin. Gusto niya po kasi na stylish, elegant, and unique na design. So this is it guys, papalapit na rin po ang Mother's Day. If you want to participate on our pag-giveaway, nasa comment section ang link and mechanics. Please don't forget to follow and like our Facebook page. Bye!